Hey guys, Louie here, and uh, today I'm gonna do a long form video, and I wanna show you a couple of things I've purchased uh, recently. We're gonna look at the Liberty Britannia Silver Metal, which is going gangbusters in the aftermarket. Very low mintage metal. And also what I picked up from the 50 cent over sale at First Mint, which is the first majestic wholly owned mint where he is supplying his own uh, virgin silver and they're pouring these beautiful bars. Uh, let's start, let's go ahead and start with that. And I'm also gonna show you uh, where you can buy these uh, if you want to, now that they have been sold out for months at the uh, US Mint. But uh, First Majestic had a sale, um, 50 cents over spot for most things in their store. And uh, I picked up this uh, 10 ounce uh, bar and I just want to commend them for the excellent quality. I don't, I don't think the pictures really do it justice. Um, my lighting is not perfect this morning, but it looks very much like a Perth Mint bar. Um, very shiny, nicely, nicely refined, obviously cast, plain back, 10 ounces, easy to hold in the hand. Uh, now these were, uh, I think I got this in the low $30 area. Um, but now with the SmackDown in prices into the low 29s are probably about the same price this morning. So uh, I'll put a link uh, down in the description uh, to First Mint if you want to pick up a 10 ounce, 5 ounce, 100 ounce, whatever. It's a nice quality piece. And uh, let's see if we can get the image to expand here. Hold on one second. So there is the image. Very nicely done. Very shiny bar. I like that a lot. Okay, so I wanted to show you that first. Uh, these are the only two things I've picked up recently, but today there's good deals everywhere. Um, here is the Liberty Britannia Silver Medal for 2024, which came out, I don't know, was it like January or March? I mean, it was ages ago. And uh, nobody thought this metal uh, would do well. Nobody bought it. Mintage was uh, like 32,000 or 34,000, literally half of the 75,000 uh, that was, uh, you know, the maximum mintage limit. And, uh, but nonetheless, uh, people hesitated to buy them. And then the U.S. Mint closed the door. They, they put it sold out prior to selling out the mintage which was somewhat unusual, making this one of the lower mintage metals. So that's why they're commanding a high price on eBay. Offering price was 89, I believe, which is a bit much for an ounce of silver, but you get a lot in this package. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. It's got beautiful packaging, which if I had to guess, I would guess that was this was made by the Royal Mint, but I don't know. It looks very similar to some Royal Mint products. There is the COA. Another aspect of potential collectability is that uh, they goofed when they made the, um, the COA and they called it a coin. <laughs> yeah, right. Coin descriptions. So I don't know if they'll fix that or not. I imagine they won't because they're not making these anymore. They closed the door on this. But uh, it is a proof. Um, one troy ounce and made in uh, Philadelphia Mint. And uh, you know it's got Liberty's depiction and Britannia's depiction on the same metal. And th there is uh, another one that has been made by the Royal Mint, which is a coin, but that one has King Charles on the obverse. So we've got the clamshell, a very nice clamshell has come back. Let me expand this a little bit. They have brought back the clamshell. This is a very nice quality clamshell. It's not overdone, it's not too big. Uh, where are the hinges? There we go. So let's go ahead and get a look at this bad boy. And uh, there it is at first look. I have seen, I bought a mess of these because I was a believer. Uh, most people were not. But um, I have seen already, I have opened, oh, over 10 of these. And every one has been basically a perfect specimen. Just beautiful, rever uh, beautiful proof. Beautiful, beautiful proof. The quality is um, amazing, really amazing. Okay, and I'm not sure if you like the image, but I'm inclined to like this particular image here. Um, it says United States of America, 
Liberty and Britannia. I think that's all you get on that side, but look at the stunning, shiny fields in that. And here is, we'll put Liberty on top. But uh, definitely, oh, did I do that wrong? There we go, 2024. And then the other way it says Liberty. So I'm not sure. I guess they kind of split the difference and put the uh, the uh, notations on the side instead of the top or bottom. But this is a U.S. Mint product and uh, just, just gorgeous. Anyway, like I said, I've seen a bunch of these and they have all been gorgeous. I haven't seen a single problem on any. I think they're going to grade MS. Uh, let's see, what is this? This is a proof. They're, they're probably going to grade PF70 and you see the graded examples going for about 200 bucks. So there it is. We should have a metal flip on that. We do. And I wanted to show it to you. If you need one of these, uh, check out my eBay store. Ask me for a discount and I'll get you the lowest price online uh, for one of these metals. Like I said, I bought a bunch of them and uh, they, uh, they are doing well. Apparently the gold is doing even better than the silver metal. But that shows you the mintage level for this. It, it's a one-off. And I don't know if you collect those or not, or if you even like metals, but I find that metals uh, can often do better than coins. So I don't know what the uh, myopic opinion about coins is. It doesn't have to be a coin to be a good performer. And this was definitely a sleeper and caught everybody by surprise when they uh, they cut off production halfway through the 75,000. So uh, anyway, if you'd like one, uh, go ahead and click the link below and you will figure out where to get one at a very reasonable price. Okay, guys, that's all I have for you today. A nice little unboxing, two little things. Hope you're having a great weekend and taking advantage of some of the lower prices because, uh, wow, they really got smacked down hard. But that's another video. If you want to talk, hear my discussion about the markets, um, you can... Uh, you can check my video out that I did early this morning on where to find the best deals. Um, here's some things that I poured recently. Um, yeah, that's uh, I do those every morning, and they are the companion piece to uh, this one just sold. Uh, they are the companion piece to um, my website, bestsilvergolddeals.com. So uh, check that out if you want to see where the best deals are on the internet. And um, if you're looking for my opinion about the SmackDown, and it was quite a SmackDown. Aren't these guitar picks cool? I think somebody's about to buy this. One of the most beautiful guitar picks I've ever poured. I'm uh, retiring in a few weeks and uh, look forward to making a lot more silver. So uh, that's what's up today. Hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. Thank you for watching the video. And if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. And I will catch you guys uh, tomorrow. See you later. Bye now.